everyone this evening. My name is Kathy and my partner Maureen right here on behalf of Sunshine Villa, what we'd like to welcome you this evening. And uh, I don't know, about two months ago or so, Rosemary came to me and she said, you know, I have these beautiful photos of Johnny and these beautiful surfboards, uh, very valuable from what I understand, and I'd like to display them somewhere. And so I said, well, why don't you bring them here? Bring them to Johnny's home. Bring it all in and we'll have a big party. So that's why we are here today. So once again, thank you everyone for coming. And we are honored to have Johnny with us at Sunshine Villa. He's just really special. And I have to tell you, I've lived in Santa Cruz 52 years, and everybody I know knows Johnny, <laughs> including everybody here. So once again, we are just delighted and we are honored. So we have a dance group that's going to come up right now and perform for us. Aloha, everyone. Aloha. We're so happy to be here. And we are Te Hao Nui Dance Company. And we are just so honored to be here to celebrate you, Johnny and Rosemary. And uh, we're going to start by taking you to, to the island of Maui. And we're going to do a number called Meikanani A'o Kaupo. How many of you have been on the road to Hana? <laughs> All the hands go up. So, Johnny's been on the road to Hana. Well, down at the end of that little road and you go a little bit west, there is that small town of Kaupo. And uh, so we are going to celebrate that beautiful town and bring you to the, um, bring a little bit of the islands to you right now as if we didn't have enough on this beautiful day. for you and uh, this is a song that's very dear to our hearts because it was written by our kumu or teacher Loea Frank Kabai Kapu Hewitt and it's called Kamali Iokapo and it is the based on the Hawaiian creation chant the kumu lipo and talks about going from that uh, darkness into enlightenment so it's one of our um, favorite numbers that we'd like to offer you today Johnny and Rosemary and uh, also, I just want to say that Eileen here is the granddaughter of Jerry Colfer, and um, both of you know who Jerry Colfer is to, uh, to Johnny, so it's very special. And Leslie also has a connection with her own parents that were dear friends of uh, Rosemary. So, and then we have Lealoha here. We will meet you now. <laughs> Okay, I'll say something about Lea Loha. You have seen Lea Loha Luann, otherwise known as Luann Corver, her absolutely gorgeous artwork in all over uh, probably the nation now. So that's Luann's work, and I'm Kumu Kale, Boulder Lane. So we will now do Kamali'i Okapo. Thank you. 
think of one word, simply beautiful. Absolutely beautiful, thank you. We now would like our mayor, Lynn Robinson, to come up. And I believe our former mayor, Hillary, is still here. If Hillary could join her. That's you, Hillary. Well, there's another Hillary uh, in Washington, so we're talking about you. <laughs> and we have a very special presentation to Johnny and Rosemary. So what a what a moment. Just thank you, Johnny, and thank you, Rosemary. We're all here having just an incredible this is Santa Cruz, you know. And I'm thinking about going through all the rooms and looking at all the photos. But especially thinking about all the connections we're making right now. And I I just want to give gratitude to the riches of each of your lives individually, but the riches of your life together. We all know it and experience it, however we are woven in part of the journey. So please take the time to really truly go look and experience everything that's on the walls for Johnny Rice Day because it's, it's, it's almost, um, there's not words for it, truly. So last year, I asked Hillary, I go, come be up here with me. She was the mayor last year, as you all know, an incredible mayor for us here in the city of Santa Cruz. And um, so last year, and she was so wonderful, she gave me the honor of coming up with her at a wonderful event that I think actually was Johnny's birthday. Was he a part of Johnny's birthday? Are you going to tell the real, the real part of the story? <laughs> yeah. Is that Johnny was so mad at us. We made it. Oh, yeah. But you know what? He was actually happy because he had the best so bowl of soup. He could care less. He, he put up with us. He put up with us. So mad. I know. But you know what? That was then and this is now, right? So we don't have a mayor's proclamation this year. It was a pretty amazing proclamation last year, and I, I was honored to be a part of that. But just knowing that, look at, I'm just looking around. We're, we're having just a special day right now, and, and Johnny's putting up with us again today. You know <laughs> so this is a certificate of appreciation, because I think in every respect, each and every one of us, dear family and dearest closest friends and then all of us that just know that we've been touched. We know we've been touched and there's so many memories we have. And on my phone, I just walk in the dog one day and up comes Johnny coming up from maybe a surf session not all that long ago. And I think Kim Stoner, I think in the picture I've got Kim and Johnny coming up the Cal stairs. So I've got to get that picture to you guys because it's one of those sweet, he just has the biggest grin. It was just one of his best days surfing. You just knew it. So I... That's, and that's just me, just walking in my neighborhood with the dog. It's like, this is Santa Cruz. So I think that's part of the, to me, the gratitude and the joie de vivre of, this is a certificate of appreciation. <coughs> Presented to Johnny Rice on this day, May 31st, 2014. This is just a thought that I wrote down. For his lifelong passion for surfing and his love of family, friends, and sacred traditions. Johnny Rice embodies the spirit of a consummate trailblazer, living life in Santa Cruz to the fullest. His life journey reminds us all of the bounty of our blessings, and especially how to live a beautiful, authentic life every day with gratitude. Johnny, we love you. Oh. 